holding the uh, West Indian fast bowl. Of course, we all know what a, what a legend he is and how much he loves his horse racing. Matt Chapman caught up with him. Michael, you learn. Sir Michael Stout for a long time. Top trainer at Royal Ascot this year. That was something a bit special. Very special. But to be honest, Matt, I'm thinking that he may think that if the Queen had won the Gold Cup again, he would have been a bit happier. Mm. But four winners at Royal Ascot, fantastic. That memory of 2013 when Estimate <laughs> powered home and the Queen was screaming in the box will live with everyone, I think, forever. Yeah, definitely. You know, when you see the Queen who loves her horses and getting so much fun out of a particular race, and remember she was supposed to be presenting the cup and she had no idea she was going to win it, then she had to get someone else to present it. That was a great day. It was really nice to see Telescope absolutely hack up, though. A horse, you, as outsiders, we always feel Sir Michael's held in huge regard. Yes, but I think the press made a lot more out of Telescope than he wanted, actually. You know, there was so much talk about Telescope winning the derby and so much pressure on him as a three-year-old. And I think Michael realised that he was a little bit immature and he just gave him time to develop and he's coming good now. You've known him for how long? I mean, you've been around here for ages, haven't you? 29 years now, man. My first time here was when Green Desert was a two-year-old. And we... Wow, Green Desert, dear, what a good horse he was. I remember him in the, in the July Cup. Um... We don't feel we know Sir Michael that well, and you were telling me a little earlier that he, he's very elusive. Isn't he? Even you, after all these years, wouldn't know everything about Stout. No, not at all, but I, I go out with him at nights. You know, he, he relaxes a lot more at nights, out having a, a meal, having a drink, and he lets his guard down. Does he? In what way? Definitely. When he's with his friends, you know, he even <laughs> say things that you wouldn't have heard him say. He just relaxes, which is what I think he enjoys. Yeah. I don't think he enjoys being in front of a camera. He obviously doesn't enjoy doing lots of interviews, but when he's out on his own with his friends, he just relaxes, and it's great. Well, certainly re relaxation is the Bajan way. Tell us, World Cup on at the moment, who are you hoping might go and win? I am not supporting a particular team, but I drew Argentina in the Investor Cricket Derby, in the Investor Cricket Pool, so I'm hoping Argentina goes on. Real good man, Michael Holding then, the uh, West Indian fast bowler. Um, he loves being up there, Newmarket, on the gallops in the morning, that's his thing, and he, he just dodders around behind um, Sir Michael and, you know, just loves it, loves his horses, that's his thing. Apart, 